Hey everybody, it's Carrie with Seed to Spoon. As I'm out here today planting our cucumbers, it is that time of year, it is amazing. We are going to be looking at what plants we should be planting next to our cucumbers and what make really good companion plants. So there's a lot of reasons why you would want to companion plant your cucumbers. First of all, there's some that help to enrich the soil. There's some plants that help to detour pests and some that just help the overall growth of your cucumber plant. So we're gonna go over our top five picks of the plants that are really good to grow next to your cucumbers for a variety of different reasons. The first group of plants I want to mention are legumes, and these are members of the legume family. So these are the peas, beans, the southern peas, all of those. We plant in rounds of all of those throughout spring and summer and then fall again. So we are constantly having some sort of bean or pea growing in our garden, and these make terrific companion plants for your cucumbers because they are one that is very unique. They pull lots of nitrogen from the air and put it down into the soil. So that way it will help to feed your cucumber by giving them extra nitrogen in the soil. So it'll really help to boost the overall health of your cucumber plant. The next plant I wanna mention is the dill plant. It is super helpful in the garden and it can really bring in a lot of beneficial critters to your garden. So lots of pollinators, along with some of the really good fighters in your garden. So things like ladybugs and the predatory wasps, which I know it doesn't necessarily sound like a great thing, but it is actually a terrific thing from your garden because these predatory wasps and ladybugs too, they can work to go and battle the bad bugs that may be plaguing your cucumbers. So keep that in mind as you see your wasps around. Marigolds are another terrific companion for your cucumbers. So not only are they beautiful and edible too, you can eat them. And check it out in the app too. I have tips on there for how to go about using them in the kitchen, just in case you're curious. But anyways, so marigolds work for a number of ways. They help to first bring in some pollinators so they can help bring in some beneficial critters such as the predatory wasp again. And these can work too to get rid of the cucumber beetles. So if cucumber beetles are plaguing you, maybe try planting one of these that attracts the predatory wasps or something like that. And marigolds actually work to also repel things like aphids and just a number of different beetles too. So if you're having any sort of pest issues, marigolds are your go-to. Root crops such as things like radish are also really good to plant near your cucumbers too. They don't take up a lot of space, but they help to break up the soil underneath the cucumbers. So that way, if you have like super dense soil, things like that, you can really help to get water soaking in, nutrients soaking in to the soil, which helps the overall health of your cucumber plant. And as a bonus, they also, especially the radish, have been known to deter the cucumber beetle as well. So another plus for having some radish around. And last but certainly not least are chives. Chives work in, again, a number of different ways. They help to bring in some beautiful flowers and they, which attracts a lot of pollinators and good beneficial critters to your garden. And these chives also help to detour the cucumber beetle as well. So if you are having trouble with the cucumber beetle, these chives can really help to disguise your cucumbers and help to throw the cucumber beetles off of their track. So these are definitely not all of the companions that you can plant with your cucumbers, but these are just our top five favorite ones that we like to use in our garden. And if you wanna see the full list, check out our free app from Seed to Spoon. And there is a section in there, if you go to cucumbers, you can go up to the friends tab and you can see the list of all of the plants in our app that make good companions for cucumbers. And along the same lines too, it'll show you the ones that do not make good companions as well. So things that you might want to avoid. So if you haven't checked out that section yet, make sure that you check that out because it is super helpful. Well, let me know if you guys have any questions at all while you are out there planting in your garden. I'm gonna go get planting some more of our cucumber seeds. See y'all next time, bye.